Let's meet our next guest. He is the unbelievably talented musical director and band leader for The Late Show with Stephen Colbert. His latest album is called We Are. Please welcome the magnificently talented John Baptiste is here tonight. Woo. John, thanks for being here. I know that yeah. we're catching you right before you're about to tape uh, Stephen's show. Um, how are you doing? Are you keeping well? I'm well, man. I'm beyond blessed. I'm just doing my thing, just like you. I see you got Reggie in there killing it, too, my man. There he is. Look, Reggie and the whole band's here. <laughs> I'm actually, you know, I'm pleased that you're here. Reggie's here. It's very nice, very nice to have you both on the same show at the same time. And I've got some questions for you, John. I was wondering, at what point, when you're in the studio with Stephen and you're doing the show, it, you know, with the whole band's there, when do you normally eat your salad? <laughs> Do you, do you eat your salad before the show or after, or do you, do you eat it during the show? When is that? You know, I, I'm trying to get like Reggie, but in, in, in the meantime, I just slip in bites on the commercial breaks. Oh, you wait in the break? Oh, interesting. And do you ever... I don't know, if you've got, like, a can of water lying around and Stephen's doing some bit about some incredible social injustice, do you ever just... Whoosh, Crack that water while he's, you know, talking or... Yeah, there you go. Or during an interview. Does that... Is that something that ever happens? I mean, you know, that's pretty avant-garde. It's innovative. I like using the sound. That could be a good little hi-hat adjustment. Oh! That was good. <laughs> Look at that! Look at that! Now, John, that's I want to fire. talk to you about this. You recently performed uh, for people who are administering vaccines. In New York, this is actually the first live in-person public event in New York since the pandemic began. What was this like? Oh, my goodness. It was like being in the future. It felt like something you would see in an episode of Star Trek where you just have these people, everybody in masks, separated, doctors, nurses, all of the essential workers, and we're playing music. Um, it, it, it felt surreal, and, and I, I was really emotional because it was the first time I had played a live performance in a year. Wow. So, um, for that to be the first time that we played, it was very meaningful to me on a number of levels. I love that. Now, let's talk about your album, We Are. This is, it's such a good record, John. It's like, it's like, it feels almost like a throwback to sort of, to a pop soul kind of vibe that runs mm -hmm. through it. And I didn't know this. You actually started recording this album in your dressing room at the Ed Sullivan yes. Theatre around Colbert tapings. How did that work? Why, why did you choose to do it there? I had this music on my heart, and it was just time to do it. You know, it was the time that I felt was right for the world, the place that I was in in my life, and I just built the studio. You know, the dressing room is not that big. <laughs> and uh, fun fact, the dressing room used to be Carol Burnett's old dressing oh, room. Oh, wow. When I got to uh, work with her, she told me that, and... Um, that just added to the inspiration that I could do anything in this space. I could just, you know, we could make it happen. So from sound check, we go upstairs, record some, go tape the show. I had some other stuff going on, go out of the studio, come back late at night working, wake up in the morning, come back in again. Six days, we had this whole blueprint for the album. Just, it was there. And then I just took the next eight months or so and just dialed in and, and really made it exactly what I wanted it to be. And there you have it. It's so good. And on the song that you're performing uh, tonight, Freedom, you've got this incredible falsetto. Now, I always thought that Reggie had the highest voice in Late Night. Reggie's got but a But now I'm voice. not I sure. I'm wondering, I'm wondering, do, do we want a falsetto off? Do we want a falsetto off? I mean, oh! I, just, I just got up, but I'll yeah. try. When, hang on. How long ago did you wake up, Reg? <laughs> like an hour ago. Right, OK. So... That's not the ideal time to test one's voice. But Who I'll wants try. to start? Who wants to start? John, do you want to start with a note? Go for it. Yeah, let's see. Da, 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 you talk, you speak in my language. No, first, that I talk, you speak in my language. How? Ooh, 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 yeah, oh, yeah, that one. Yeah. Ah, ah. Oh, God. <laughs> Half step up. Oh, hey, oh, good girl. Oh, I got it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, nice. We're going low. No. No, hold it. No, hold it. Okay, I got it. No. <laughs> 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 I 
Here we go. <laughs> nah, oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, we're going to call it a draw. <laughs> Look at that. He's got two more talented people in the world. Incredible. Hey, my brother Red, man. Yes, baby. You oh, man. That. Much respect to you, man. Much now, respect. John, we have to congratulate you, uh, and, and this has been such an incredible thing this year. You've won the Golden Globe, the Critics' Choice, and the BAFTA Award uh, for the score from the Pixar movie Soul. The Academy Awards are coming up. Uh, do you have your acceptance speech ready for the Oscars? Oh, my goodness. I, I am grateful to be nominated, and I wrote a little something. I'm excited to be there and see everybody. It's the first award show out of all of them that's in person. Um, so we're gonna go, and um, I'm just gonna soak it all in. It's a true blessing to have even made this film, let yeah. alone now having this nomination. So I'm, yes, I will. I have something prepared. I'll say that. <laughs> well, we're incredibly proud of you, and we're honored to have you on the show tonight, John Baptiste. Everybody, when we come back, John Baptiste is gonna perform right here on the show. Come on back, everybody.